Hey, what's up everybody? This is Steve with Cine Samples, and we're taking a look at our new update for Cine Orc, now called Orchestral Chords. This is one of my favorite products in our collection. I'm really excited that we've updated it, given it a great new interface, made it compatible with the free contact player 6.6.1 or later, and the complete control plugin. This is a super useful library, which contains full orchestra, playing chords, major, minor, and other chords in different orchestrations and instrumentations and inversions, mapped to the keyboard in a really simple and straightforward way. So we've got the low chords patch, which has the brass muted strings, really beautiful texture. We've got the 2D chords patch, which is the full ensemble, which gets more of the high woodwinds, the high brass, multiple octave variants. something really amazing about recording an ensemble all together in a space where you get the interaction of the instruments in the room with each other as well as with the acoustic space. All the combinations of woodwinds, brass, strings playing together and interacting with the recording room is just such a powerful texture. It really adds a lot of magic. So that's one of the reasons I really love this library is it captures that sound so well and gives you the ability to add that to your compositions just with a touch of a button. It's really awesome. In addition to chords, we sampled the orchestra playing octaves with different instrumentations because we want to be able to build our own chords for things that are not, uh, not major or minor. So we've got marcato articulation mapped down here on the blue keys. Nice, powerful sound there. And on the yellow keys, we have splits between the staccato and the sustain. So same as we have with the 2D chords. We have the option to choose whether we're controlling the dynamics with velocity or CC, and then choose which CC it is. I'm using CC1 mod wheel and then change the crossover point for when the staccato or sustain will play. In this case, it's staccatos on high velocity above 101. So if I play below 101, I'll hear the sustain and control the dynamics. And you can also use the Titan Staccato knob to get a more pronounced attack. So here's what it sounds like by the default. If I tighten it up, it gets a much more pronounced attack. Turn the knob down. a little bit looser gives you a little bit more dynamics dynamic performance and then we've got the Vivaldi tremolo patch this is a really fun one with the full string ensemble doing a really aggressive exaggerated tremolo can also control the split so you can see the green keys and blue keys adjusting. This is where the low strings versus mid and high strings will come in. So yeah, that's orchestral chords. Owners of the Cine Orc library, keep an eye on your email. You'll be getting an upgrade coupon to purchase this new version of this library. We're really excited to have orchestral chords available for the free contact player. We're working on several updates for our libraries in this fashion. We've done Piano and Blue recently, and it looks like you get a sneak preview of what's coming next. Stay tuned for many more exciting announcements from CineSamples coming soon.